So what would you do if someone stole your things? Would you sit back and wait for police to find them for you? Not one man. He's fighting to get his stuff back. He's tracked down surveillance video, posted it on the web, all hoping to find the thief. The night team's Kimberly Nelson with the story of a man on a mission, a story you'll see on just one station. Eric Lamb had his backpack stolen from this McDonald's in Medvale. Now he's taking the investigation into his own hands, using the surveillance video and turning it into some sort of YouTube music video, hoping that will help catch that backpack thief. A Sunday night at McDonald's cost the Lamb family more than a couple of Happy Meals. Everything in that backpack was around $500 worth of stuff. Crystal's husband, Eric, is studying to be an occupational therapist. He was doing some homework while he let his kids play Sunday night, but when they got up to leave... I must have forgot I left my backpack on the table. This is the guy who found Eric's backpack, only he didn't return it. Um, he was there while we were there. Um, our kids were playing together. At first I was really shocked just because our kids had played together and, and you know, they were sitting right by us. McDonald's gave Eric the surveillance of the backpack thief, and while he called police, he took matters into his own hands and put the video on the internet. Send it to everyone on my Facebook, told them to send it to everyone else. So far, more than 200 people have viewed the YouTube link, one of whom contacted us at ABC4 for help. Eric says he'd be happy if someone just returned his stuff. Really, that's all I want. I just want my stuff back. I don't want to have to try and redo all of my homework. Eric says all he wants is his backpack and homework back. He's even set up an email account hoping that tipsters can write in. That email account is findmybackpack.com. Reporting in the Bell, Kimberly Nelson, ABC4 News 19.